Okay. Wait a minute. That's right. This is going to be to clarify. There we go. Okay. Hey, Taurus. What's up? What's up? What's up, Taurus? What's up? What's up? What's up? So, Taurus, listen. We're going to do a money reading, okay? Um, We're just, we're, we're going to focus on money for a little bit. We are. We're going to focus on money for a little bit because that's what you guys are focused on. There's a lot of you who are just focused on money because you're trying to forget somebody. And that's fine. That's fine. You know what I mean? Like, throw yourself in work. Make money. Like, that's fine. Do what you got to do to get over what you got to get over. Like, it is what it is, right? So, totally get it, okay? But I'm going to tell you something. I'm going to tell you something. And a lot of you don't, a lot of you don't get it. A lot of you don't get it. Like, I'm literally being told, like, they don't get it. Like, they just don't get it. Like, when are they going to get it? When are they going to get it? You got money coming. Don't get me wrong, okay? You got money coming. You guys are very resourceful. There's always money available to you. It's just a given. It's like you... What is it? It's uh, 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 it's how you guys resonate money, okay? There's always going to be money around you. You're always going to be surrounded by money, okay? That's not a problem. The problem is, Taurus, is that a lot of you think that you're going to be happy once you get the money that you want, but not realizing that you put so much on the back burner along the way that, yeah, you're going to have money and you'll be able to get everything you want, but are you going to be happy? That's really the question here. If you're going to be happy with just the money, then more power to you. That's what I'm hearing. I'm hearing that some of you are going to be fine. Like some of you are like, yeah, no, fuck it. As long as I got the money and I'm living my life, fuck everybody else. And that's fine. And that's fine. If that's your intention, that's fine. But then others of you, that's not your intention, but you're not realizing that that's what's happening to you. You understand what I'm saying? Does that make sense? You know, so just be super mindful of that, Taurus, because you actually can have it all. <laughs> you can have the money and you can have the love and the emotion and all that stuff. You can have all that. But a lot of you are really putting what you truly want to the back burner because you're so focused and really fixed on making the money because you feel like that's how you measure your success. You don't need to measure your success by that. You don't. You need to measure your success by how you treat people, how you interact with people. Your lesson, Taurus, honestly, for this kind of like Scorpio season going in when it comes to like the money and stuff is that one can't exist without the other. Like money and love, they coexist together because without one, you can't have the other. You know what I'm saying? Like it's just their energies. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, just be mindful of that. All right. So just be aware of that because you can have it all. You can have it all. You can have it all. You can. You can. But the energy's got to be right. You got to have, you, the energy's got to be right. You guys got to like, you got to listen to like your intuition. You got to listen to what's going on. Like you got to listen, you know? So anyway, listen, we're going to get <clears throat> overall energy with my money oracle. Okay. So we're just going to get overall energy. What's going on? Cause you guys got money coming in regardless, you know? So I never really worry about these money readings, but we're just going to see. Cause sometimes it gives you a little bit of a, a clue into maybe something you got to be weary about, like maybe contracts or shit like that. So we'll see. But we're going to do some overall energy with the money oracle. Then we're going to get some money cards as well. I'll clarify if I feel the need. And then we'll get a uh, manifesting monology oracle at the end. All right. So let's dive into it. So for my Taurus, my Taurus who are watching now. And my Taurus who will be watching later. Um. Wow. And you know what? It's It's really not a surprise that. I feel like this while I'm doing your guys' reading. Um, and you're going to hold on one second, Taurus, because I'm hungry. Okay, I'm back, guys. Sorry. It's just that my, my stomach is growling during the reading, and I don't think that's cute at all. It's really just not cute. So I just need to take a little bite of something. This is the um, pumpkin muffin from Starbucks. I don't know. It was just something to grab, you know? But not a surprise that I'm hungry during a tourist reading. <laughs> because you guys are all about food. You guys like your food. I like this food too, though. Mm -hmm. It's not bad not bad all right sorry Taurus but I just I needed a little something all right thank you 
What did I say? What did I say? What did I say at the beginning of the fucking reading? I said for the focus not to be solely on fucking money, right? Didn't I say that? You guys know I said it. You guys know I said it. Look at the overall energy. And it's not, listen, calm down. Calm down, okay? It's not that you guys are thinking like, oh my God, greedy, I want all the fucking money. No, it's not that. It's not even that really that, that thinking. It's the sign that you're overthinking the fact that it's only about money. You have to focus on other things in your life, making time for things that are important. A lot of you are not doing that. Like a small percentage of you do try, you know what I'm saying, here and there, but you have to try harder. But isn't that shit fucking hysterical? You see what I'm saying? Can't make this shit up. I'm telling you. Can't make this shit up. What else? Can I throw it? Oh. Damn, guys. Jeez. Didn't I also say that a lot of you are not allowing yourselves to be guided, right? Like, that it's almost like, you know, you're just going against, like, the things that you need to do. I always say that about you guys. Look at Guided by spirit. Like, it's like they're trying to nudge you in the proper direction, but a lot of you are very stubborn. You're like, nope. And you're blocking a lot of things that can be coming in. That's what I'm saying. You, you can have it all. I've been saying this. Didn't I say this? You die financially being taken. Look at that. You are financially being taken advantage of. Some of you. And then things coming in at the perfect time. Like I said, money always coming in. Like that's not, that's not, that's neither here nor there. Like that's what I'm saying. Like it's not an option about like money and it's not a question about money. But some of you are blocking even more abundance from coming in because you're not focusing on the love factor of stuff. Okay. Or just focusing on emotions and other things and other aspects in your life. So it, And it affects your money. It affects your money. It affects your money. Let me see. Why is you are being financially taken advantage of here? Ooh, for some of you, I heard it's like a wife or, yeah. For some of you, I heard it's like a significant other that's like skimming money. I know that sounds crazy and so like like betrayal type of thing. But yeah, it's um like somebody's hiding money from you or like they make money and they hide it on the side. But then they, you, you know, like it's almost like they're hiding their income. Like somebody's hiding their income from you, Taurus. Somebody. Somebody's hiding their income from you, like... Some people are making more money than they say that they're making and they're not giving you like a cut type of shit. That's the type of shit that's going on. Um, why is guys by spirit here? Yeah, and they're blocking. It could be a fire sign. Um, And they're blocking that income from coming in. Mm-hmm. Yeah, look at, see? When you feel like you're stressed out the most, you literally try to get signs, but you don't pay attention to them. You have to start waking up and paying attention to when you're going through your rough times. I guarantee you that something weird happens where you're where you feel like an intuitive thing to do something, but then you go against it and then you wanna like smack yourself in the face after for not paying attention. Guaranteed for some of you. Guaranteed. Why is perfect timing here? Mm hmm Yeah, see, there's like outside money coming in. Outside sources. Unexpected money that was just out there. It could be like a 401k I'm hearing for some of you. Like one that you had closed out, but like... It never got sent to you type of stuff. You know how that things like that happen? Like wacky things like that happen? So for some of you, I'm hearing that. It could be like an old like account. Like an old account. Alright, let's see. What else for my Taurus? I 
I'm hearing um abundance, but where's the love? And then I heard that song, you know, where is the love? The love. Where is the love? The love. The love. That's for you, Taurus, literally. Candle and watch. So look at, see, look, it's time to profit. Divine timing, seize the moment. You got divine timing again here twice. Waiting period. Laid off some of you, like not working. That's what I'm saying. Like finding your passion, finding things that you're wanting to do. Ambition, taking action, hustle, manifesting money, uh, management, high rank, visibility, athletic careers, things like that. I'm telling you, I'm telling you. All right, let's see. One final message for my Taurus. Some of you, some of you, I just heard lawsuit and like a big payout. I just heard that. Like I heard lawsuit and then like big payout. So I heard it. So I said, let me say it. The reading's still going on. So I'm like, I said it. One final message for my Taurus. Be humble. Yep. Yep. Because you listen, because you're always going to you're always going to have capability of money. Money is always going to be at your disposal. It's just like I said, it's whether you want to have it all or not. It's your choice. All right. But that's what I have for you guys, Taurus. I hope that it resonates. Don't forget to let me know. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. You guys know how much I love and appreciate you so much. Don't forget to follow me on all other social media platforms. And I do take personal so you can always message or DM me if anything. All right. So. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.